Oh, hi there. I'm Brandon, and as an employee of both Tamarack Nature Center and Ramsey County Soil and Water Conservation, protecting our natural environment is very important to me, which is why I'm out here at Tamarack today to talk a little bit about invasive species. Invasive species are a leading threat to native species, second, in fact, only to habitat destruction. Many of them can release chemicals into the ground which inhibit the growth of native species. And what's more, they can be harmful to human and animal health. They can cause erosion and alter waterways and even lower property values. One of the worst offenders here at Tamarack is garlic mustard, seen here in its flowering form and here in its basal or first year form. This pesky invasive gets its name from the garlic odor that's released when you rub its leaves. It establishes itself on the forest floor and once established, it can be a danger to native species and inhibit their growth. It is especially a threat because of how easily it is spread, not only by natural elements, but also by shoes, tires, and even lawnmowers. Not only are invasives easily spread, but they are sometimes even sold in nurseries, believe it or not. Take, for example, Oriental Bittersweet, a non-native Asian vine that is replacing American Bittersweet. It's spreading rapidly due to being improperly identified and, again, sold by nurseries. We advise that you avoid buying Bittersweet altogether because we don't know if it's a hybrid or if it has been improperly identified. Affectionately known as black dog strangling vine, black swallowwort is another vine which forms thick masses and chokes out competition. It has charming flowers which enables its spread by well-intended gardeners, but it is a dangerous invasive nonetheless. Both of those vines appear on the Minnesota Noxious Eradication List, which is a list of weeds that must be destroyed when and where they are found. They also may not be transported or sold. If you want more information about what you can do to help prevent the spread of invasive species, please visit the Ramsey County Soil and Water Conservation webpage and click on the Cooperative Weed Management Area link for more information on these and other invasive species and what you can do to stop the spread. Thank you for joining me at Beautiful Tamarack today and thank you for helping to protect Minnesota native species.